Gloadine is a drawing about two souls on a lifelong trip. I believe my mother Vivi was inspired by the star sign of Pisces, but the key to it surely were her walks near the sea outside our house. Every time she wanted to take her mind off, she always looked over it from our garden and eventually reached the shore, so that she could feel the cold water on her feet. I imagine she'd hang on in there reflecting on her life and, for this drawing, on the deep meaning of the Pisces, always one next to the other, as if they were bound by an invisible thread. She tried to transpose this deep feeling of attachment to the canvas, letting the bright color speak for her. I think she thought of the fish in the drawing as the star sign, two separate identities so deeply connected and similar to each other, that they end up being one single entity. Little by little, the Pisces almost overlap and take on themselves the colors of everything that surrounds them, keeping it forever. They will keep swimming forever, as the Pisces and the stars, and it will all be fine as long as they guide each other. However, I would say that what my mother paints here is not only the power of love in our life and the strength we gain from it, in order to be brave enough to step into the future. The two fish swim one next to the other, but still, they do it by themselves. Their invisible bond only gave them the self-confidence they needed to start their journey without being scared. Knowing her, I think that what she found most fascinating was the invitation to swim with your other half. But to never forget that you can swim alone too. The two fish, the Pisces, do go together, but you can still see where each one of them ends and where begins the other. What we need in life is an invisible thread with two ends, one attached to our other half, and the other deeply rooted inside each of us, from the heart to the head, and all our body. Thinking of her, I can almost see her thoughts running fast and her need to express the greatness of mankind, the beauty of being so fragile and strong at the same time.